Hey guys, what's up? It's Lisa from TwoCreatorWebsite.com and today I want to talk about the difference between a WordPress post and a page and search engine optimization. I often get that question a lot. Which is better for SEO? And I'm going to tell you what I believe from my own experience and I would love to open up the floor to you guys to leave comments or video responses to share what has worked for you or what you've noticed with your own site. Now, it's my understanding that from a technical standpoint, the search engines don't really care whether it's a post or a page. It's just a URL with content. What really matters is what you do with that post or that page on your site and things like on-page SEO. You know, everybody's always talking about backlinks, 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 but let's not forget about on-page SEO, internal links using anchor text. So if you want to rank for a certain keyword, using that keyword or variations of that keyword and linking to that page from multiple pages or posts throughout your website. So it's not always just about the backlinks. So for example, a lot of people have said that their posts tend to do better in the short term while their pages do better long term. And why that may be for some people is let's say you have a traditional blog where your latest posts on the home page are at the top and then your um, older posts are at the bottom. You just have a traditional structure. You're not using a static home page. And let's say you have a fairly popular blog, right? And you're writing on newsy topics. And in that first week of your blog post, it gets a ton of shares. It's linked from your home page. Google, for example, loves fresh, popular content. So if Google sees all these shares, it's linked from your home page, those are great ingredients for um, optimizing your site when it comes to SEO, right? So it may do very well in the short term. And the reason why pages, some people are saying their pages perform better long term is because a lot of people use pages for their important, evergreen um, content that they just really want to highlight. Important content that needs to remain visible from common areas of the website like your left navigation or your top navigation. For example on my hair blog I actually use a lot of pages because I want that site to look more like a traditional website. I don't update it very often so I don't want it to have you know blog post, blog post, blog post, blog post and you know category, category, category. It's more important for me to highlight the information so it, it functions actually more like a static website even though it's a WordPress site. So in my experience my pages tend to do better with the search engines on that site because of how I have them linked. They're linked on common areas and I also interlink my pages within my posts and pages using anchor text or keywords or variations of the keywords that I want to rank for. So I, I think it's important to remember that SEO is not just about backlinks. The one thing that bugs the crap out of me today is that People are so obsessed with backlinks and while they are important, you can't forget on page criteria. Are you linking to your content from other pages and posts on your site? So I don't think it really matters whether it's a post or a page from an SEO standpoint. What really matters is the structure of your website and how you're using that post and that page throughout your site, at least from my experience. So I love to hear what you guys have to say. Let me know and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.